There are several things I'd like to comment on. Let's see if I can stay consistent with numbers and letters here. I always go like one, two, C. So, um, wish me luck. Okay, one, that song was beautiful. It really was. Uh, two, the beatboxing gets my approval right there. Three, speaking of music or just in the topic of music and something we have a little in common. I just came back from a Ben Folds concert. It's the first time I've seen him headlining a concert and dear God, that man. It was so good. The only drawback is that since I had bought, purchased two tickets, one for me and one for my girlfriend, and then broke up with my girlfriend and then didn't really think about it until yesterday um, and went, shit, I've got to find somebody to go to this concert with me. And I scrambled. None of my friends either didn't know who he was, didn't want to go with me, or couldn't make it. No one. Not even my own mother or my father could make it. Now, my brother... But one person did come with me to enjoy the experience, and that was my little sister. So I took my little sister out to the Ben Folds concert, and I opened her eyes, whether she wanted them opened or not, and it was glorious. What number am I on, guys? Shit. Four. Let's call it four. I like four. Fourth, uh, the election. It was such such a happy moment. I didn't make an election video and people were like, why? And I was like, because I was just relishing in the moment. And I shared the experience with my best friend E and my mother. And we were in the living room just enjoying it because we were the, probably the only blue house in a sea of red. I do live in Arizona. Yeah. But Arizona did manage a 45% Democratic vote. That's amazing. 45%. That's almost 50-50. Holy crap, what a push. I was beyond happy. And like you said, step forward, step back. Prop 8 in California is horrific. Um, here in Arizona, we decided to take it one step further. And we're going to try and amend the Constitution to define it as one man and one woman. It's like I went up to the ballot and it's like either keep things the way they are or make them worse. Hmm, let me think about that. Aye. Uh, fifth thing? Fourth, fifth, yeah, fifth or sixth, whatever. YouTube Live. I've been hearing a lot of thing about th stuff about it and I'm like, eh, 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 I don't know, it's just one more thing. I don't have time, blah, blah. But now you're like, I'm in it. And I'm like, well, shit, now I gotta watch it. In case I want to make a video about it. Thanks. The next thing, and probably the last thing because it's late. Academically, um, take your time in deciding. Honestly, it's it's something that it does matter. And, you know, do whatever you're going to feel is right for you and the best fit for you. Whether that's music or not. And I know that I'm just trying to finish up my, um, my bachelor. And today I just received the first D on a test that I've received in my life, much less my college career. It was in statistics. Oh, <laughs> it was bad. Um, yeah, not too happy about it. But um, I'm reaching out, trying to plan for my master's, and I'm kind of in the same spot you are going, what do I want to do with my life? How is this going to help? Which path should I take? Where should I go? That's a whole other video. But um, you gave me a lot of stuff to think about and to con comment to, and I haven't really conversed with you in a while, so I hope all is well and that you just keep pushing forward uh, through everything that you're going through. Embrace the ones you love. Have a good night.